The working presidency took its act to the southern frontier to lead a distribution of rice sacks to at least 2,500 recipients in Zamboanga City and Zamboanga Sibugay and listen to their concerns. Likewise, he also urged the public to support and exploit the government's rice cap program to ease and mitigate the effects of inflation. Our Kenneth Pashente has more. Amidst the challenges facing the agricultural sector, the government continues to help affected individuals. So today, President Ferdinand R. Marcos Jr. himself led the rice distribution in Zamboanga City, where the chief executive distributed 1,500 sacks of rice to the beneficiaries of the Pantawid Pamilyang Pilipino Program in Region 9. This is part of the over 42,000 smuggled sacks of rice seized by the Bureau of Customs Port of Zamboanga last week, amounting to 42 million pesos. According to President Marcos Jr., BOC Zamboanga tried to talk to the consignee and requested them to provide relevant documents. However, Natapos na po ang 15 days, hindi po sila makasagot. Kaya kinuha na namin, kinuha na ng gobyerno, kinuha na ng customs at ginawang donations sa DSWD at gagawing donation ng DSWD at ng gobyerno sa inyo. The president also reminded consumers not to buy rice beyond the price cap set by the government for regular and well-milled rice. The chief executive also eased farmers' grievances over the effects of the price cap on their incomes by way of increasing the buying price range of the NFA for the husk grains or palay. Baka mahirapan ng kumita yung mga magsasaka. Kaya kahapon lamang ay pinalitan natin at uh, ginawa natin Ang uh, pagbili ng NFA, 19 pesos to, ay 16 pesos to 19 pesos para sa, sa wet na palay at 19 pesos hanggang 24 para sa dry na palay. Kaya tataasan natin ng pambili para sa mga farmer. And because of the threat of the possible effects of El Nino, President Marcos Jr. assured the government is taking the necessary steps to boost rice production in the country and secure the country's rice buffer stock. At lagi kong pinapaalala sa lahat ng mga kasamahan ko, hindi lamang na kailangan na may sapat na pagkain, ay kailangan may, may presyo na kayang bilhin ng taong bayan, unang-una. Pangalawa, na may magandang hanap buhay naman ang mga magsasaka. Kaya at yan ang tinitiyak natin. At, uh, at titignan po natin uh, sa habang tumatakbo ang panahon, titignan po natin na uh, papano na ang magiging mga pangangailangan na ating mga kababayan para naman ay hindi natin masasabi na gino, ginutom na ang mga Pilipino. The president also distributed 1,025 kilo rice sacks to the residents of the municipality of Tongawan in Zamboanga, Sipugay. In addition, the president also led the turnover of millions of funds for different agriculture projects in the region and livelihood assistance. Kenneth Pasyente for The Nation.